This is Marcel Brown bringing you some technology history for November 24th and 25th. November 24th, 1998. AOL announces it will buy Netscape Communications in a stock-for-stock -stock deal worth approximately $4.2 billion. At the time, it was considered a move by AOL and Netscape to merge forces to better compete with Microsoft in the browser and internet provider markets. However, Microsoft's dominance in the personal computer market could not be stopped, and the Netscape browser lost almost all market share to Internet Explorer. In 2003, Microsoft settled a monopoly lawsuit with AOL, then merged with Time Warner, for $750 million over the loss of the value of Netscape. AOL itself, once a dominant Internet service provider, slowly lost their subscriber base with the evolution of broadband internet service in the early 2000s. The source code from Netscape was eventually released as open source and became the foundation for the Mozilla Firefox browser. November 25, 2002 Digital media software company Roxio purchases the assets of the former Napster, including name, logo, domain name, technology portfolio, and other intellectual property. Napster was the peer-to-peer file-sharing service that changed the music industry forever, facilitating the easy sharing of music, much to the chagrin of the established music industry. The RIAA sued Napster, causing a judgment against the file-sharing service, requiring them to monitor its network for copyright infringing material and restrict access when made aware of such incidents. Napster could not comply with this court order and shut down its service before declaring bankruptcy in 2002. Roxio was the first company to attempt to use the Napster brand for a music service, renaming Pressplay as Napster 2.0. In September 2008, Best Buy purchased the Napster service for $121 million before merging it with the Rhapsody service in December 2011. That's your technology history for this week. For more, tune in next week and visit my website, thisdayintechhistory.com.